Hey folks, in this Master That Riff lesson I'm going to show you how to play uh, the riff to Gypsy Road. This is a nice quick one, it's only two bars long. I'm in standard tuning, and what I'm going to start off with is the first bar that sounds like this. Okay, so what I'm doing here is I'm going to be doing a bend, half step bend, third finger, fourth fret of that A string there. Okay, quick up and down, so it lasts for one beat. Then I'm going to play second fret of that A string. And I'm basically playing like a B power chord here. And what I'm going to do is bar with my third finger on the fourth fret of the D and uh, G strings there. But the way you want to play it is don't play it and let the chord ring together. Try and separate the this note in the A string with the notes in the D and the G strings. Now, Tom Kiefer plays it like this. Um, if I was actually playing that, I might actually use my fourth finger to bar that so I can keep this separation of what's happening in the A string and what's happening in the D and G strings, you know, kind of nice and clean. But that's our kind of first bar. Next bar, I'm going to play 0, 2, 4 in that A string. And then this is the tricky bit, because you have to go back to the fourth fret of the D and the G strings here. Now, my third finger has never been great at barring. This is why I'm reluctant to even do it like this. But Tom Kiefer, when he does it, he just collapses that third finger to get the, the notes in the D and G strings. I would end up hearing that note in the fourth fret there. So to keep that separate, I move my third finger up. Yeah, and then you have another one of the second fret A string and then the double stop there in the fourth fret, the D and G strings. But again, just notice as I play that, I'm taking my third finger off, playing that first finger on the, the second fret A string there to get back to that. So the two bars slowly sounds like this. Yeah. Now you basically play that, you're playing it four times. Um, and then the fourth time, you lead into the verse like that. So you've just done the. Then I'm going to play 0, 3, 4 in that E string. And then play an A power chord. Yeah. So it's a great riff. Um, Gypsy Road is one of my all time favourite songs. And I think it's mostly because it's kind of bluesy vibe of this riff. You know, it's very simple, just two bars, but it's really kind of effective. So there you go guys, Riff the Gypsy Rose. If you want access to the tab for this, or the animated tab, or uh, all the extras that you get over at Patreon, come over to the Patreon group and check out the stuff that's on there. For as little as a dollar a month, you can get access to loads of materials on there. Uh, you can also follow me on uh, Instagram and Facebook and Twitter as well if you're on those platforms. So have fun with that guys, see you soon.